All right, everyone. Hello and welcome back to Gotham Knights. This is my second session of gameplay of the game. Yesterday, if you remember, we had arrived here in Blackgate Prison, and we had talked to Harley Quinn. She's sending us down to the basement. Um, we healed, and then we walked to the next area, but apparently the game did not save, so I had to heal again. <clears throat> These are the guys I have to fight again, right? Yeah, we had already fought them, but they're making us fight them again. Should I just run up and do the attack? Let's do this. <clears throat> it's an instant takedown if you run up. See that? Oh, they hit, the, they hit their friend. Did you see that? They hit their own friend because I dodged. That was kind of neat. <laughs> Admittedly, I liked that. That was neat. They, they can strike each other if you dodge at the right time. I like that. <clears throat> Very good. Okay. More assholes in there. Nothing in here? No. Okay. Uh, cross the yard. So I don't have to fight? Oh, okay. I don't have to fight. I can be stealthy. So I go need us is there needs to be a counter button? Do you mean to counter attacks? I know there is none. There's absolutely no no counter in this game. Only dodge. That's one of the major changes from the Gotham series. Okay. <clears throat> So there you go, no reason to take them all out, right? Just be stealthy about it. There you go. I think this game will be a combination of stealth and, you know, offense. There was an <clears throat> elevator back by processing. So that probably leads to the basement. Get the volume up a little bit here. You guys let me know how the volume sounds, please. If you think it's too low or whatever, let me know. You know, every game is different. I already changed it last night for Street Fighter, so I might have to change it back again. <laughs> Holy shit! Large Marge is in charge. Tonight is looking up. The incredible bulk. <laughs> oh my god! She's immune to the stars. Oh Jesus fuck! Holy fucking shit! Uh, uh. have it yet. Oh! Too quick for you, huh? Oh. Don't I have it or do I have it? Don't have it yet. Almost. Oh! Super armor. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Take this! Batarang Barrage! It did nothing! It literally did nothing to her. She ignored it. The heavy attack stun her. I do heavy attack. There we go. Okay. Jeez. And then when she's dead, you can walk through her body and crawl inside of it. Look. Oh, crap! Flash kick! She had a guile flash kick. <laughs> that was pretty cool. El Grey Zoro says, any plans to play One Piece Odyssey? Yes, because it plays like Dragon Quest, right? And I love Dragon Quest, so I'm down for a One Piece RPG that's like Dragon Quest. I'll play that one for sure. All right, I got two more tips that came in here. <clears throat> Let's see here. If you go to the gear tab, which how do you do that? Hold back select to open the menu. There's a menu in here called styles. Yes, we already looked at this. You can customize the gear your character has on. We already looked at this. But oh, I see what you're saying. You're saying you can customize each piece. Oh, okay.
Oh, I can take off those stupid... You know what they are? I thought they were Nikes. They're not. They're Tims. You could change them. Timberlands. So I changed her appearance. I think it looks a little better. I do think that looks a little better. She took the stupid sneakers off. You know what? It looks more like a bat suit now, doesn't it? All right. Well, thank you to the anonymous dollar tipper for that. Whoever that was, thank you. That was actually a good a good piece of advice, and I'm gonna do that with all the other characters today as well, right? We'll mess around with those customizations and see which what the best combo is, because I think that looks better. <clears throat> now that the stupid sneakers are off, God, those look dumb. All right, and another tip came in. A $2 tip, and uh, WB Montreal is a mediocre dev team. I hope they move forward. Only Rocksteady is trusted with Batman and other DC games. Gotham Knights isn't terrible, but it's unremarkable, forgettable, and soulless. I mean, again, we're we're three hours in. I'm not feeling that yet, but it very much, I guess, could become that way if it really does become grindy and repetitive, but we haven't gotten to that point yet. So let's not jump the gun here. Let's, uh, let's give it a chance, right? Let's judge it for what it is at face value rather than being all negative about it, okay? All right, here we go. That looks way better. It really does. Just the color of her shoes and, like, her mask looking different just makes it look so much better. Here we go. Did it miss? It did. So it only hits a very small radius, and the problem is it doesn't show you that radius before she throws the battering. Meaning, you're going to miss. What the? Why'd the guard punch me? You fucking asshole. Like, I understand I'm not supposed to be in here, but the guard hitting me is bullshit. Take this. I love that. I actually love that finisher combo right there. I better heal, too. There we go. What's that? What the hell is that? Some collectible I got from the guy, I guess. Or uh, an upgrade item, maybe. I don't know. Oh, that's right. We gotta use this to see what's in the environment, right? Anything that I should open or loot? Looks like there might be a box over here to loot. There is a box over here to loot. Cool. Here we go. Nice. Oh, those... I think those can be used to... Like, you can hit them with your projectiles and they blow up and cause, like, area effect damage. How do I get to this box? Just walk over here? Yeah. I guess I gotta pay attention to my environment to get these crafting materials, right? Tyrone says, is Batman in this? He was, but he's dead. I don't know if they're gonna break... The, the thing is, with games like this, I have a really hard time believing Batman is dead. I get the feeling he's gonna come back at the end. Like, you just get that that feeling whenever there's a Batman game. and Oh, Batman's dead. Yeah, okay. Sure he is, right? Like, I think there'll be a twist ending where he comes back to save the day at the end or something, you know? That's my feeling. <clears throat> but, uh, he's supposed to be dead. He's definitely supposed to be dead. Jesus, you're loving this because he's a big fan of Batman. I'm glad to hear that. You know, I love Batman animated series and stuff like that. And I love the Arkham series, so. Possibilities are endless. There's a big boy right there, so I gotta see if I can do all stealth. And maybe I can take him down with stealth if they let me. We'll find out. I guess not. Special. He blocked it. I did my special move and he blocked it. But I can guard break by doing heavies like this. So really his shield's completely ineffective. Because I need to keep doing this over and over. Just when he holds it up. I gotta dodge once and then I can go right back into hitting him. See? You can't grab him, I'm assuming, right now. You can't grab the guy with the shield. He's owned. He got owned. Do the characters' combos feel unique? No, but their abilities are unique. The combos seem generic, but the abilities seem different. And also their ranged attacks. Like, Red Hood had the direct gunshots, while she has these ninja stars that kind of curve and they feel a little different. <clears throat> like, for example, I feel like when I'm, when I'm Red Hood, I absolutely want to integrate the guns into the combos. But with her, I probably wouldn't want to put the ninja stars in the combos. I probably only want to use those for, like, like long-range disabling or something, or interrupting. You see? The, the combat does feel a little different in each character. <clears throat> so. 
Fens is here. He said, I'd like to see them remake the Warriors game with one of these engines. That'd be crazy. The Warriors PS2 game. <clears throat> I don't think they would do that only because, sadly, you know, no one really remembers what the Warriors are anymore. It's a good movie. Harley likes to string people along, but she wouldn't have sent me here for no reason. What did she hmm. want me to find? What lurks in the basement? Warriors! Come out to play! Oh, warriors, come out and play! Time to check the card catalog. <clears throat> Find and examine the marked items. Like this? Old newspaper, Gotham Gazette from 1847. Grave robbers in Gotham. At least a dozen graves were dug up in the cemetery last night. <clears throat> A local woman claims to have seen her husband walking around, and he's dead. That's no good. Once your loved one's dead, and, uh, you know, and decaying, various levels of decay, probably be pretty rough to see him out and about, I'm just saying. Here we go. Can I address Keemstar? Absolutely not. I don't know what, what's going on with Keemstar. I don't care. I don't want to know. I told you, I'm done with that guy. I haven't said a word about him in ages. I don't give a fuck about the guy. He's going to talk shit. He's going to do whatever he wants. He's talking to him fuck himself and his teenager audience or whatever. I have nothing to do with it. I'm, I'm not involved, okay? <clears throat> okay. Prisoner profile. Cyrus Gold. Convict, they say. Crook, they say. Murderer, they say. But soon peace will be mine. Died on Saturday, buried on Sunday, born on Monday. They have no idea. That sounds like Solomon Grundy, doesn't it? An attached note from the guard confirms they did, in fact, have no idea what Gold was writing about. He died later that month during a planned transfer to Arkham Asylum on a Saturday. Right? That does... That sounds like like Grundy's um, rhyme, but that obviously wasn't Solomon Grundy. That was somebody else, right? Is it possible to change characters every mission? Yes. As long as you go to... Um, Back to the Belfry or whatever. Every mission you could change. <clears throat> what was that? Why did we just hear Harley? No, from the warden. Joan Crown. She's been here before. Her name was Elliot back then. They say a string of murders resembles what's in her novels. That's rich. She's a writer for Pete's sake. She reads the paper. Put her in a private cell. Don't worry. Her ilk never stick around for long. She'll be out before we know it. Tell her thanks for signing my book. I have no idea what that means. <laughs> None. Here's the last one. Business card. Jonathan Brindy was a Gotham City lawyer in the mid-1800s. He earned some notoriety for assisting former slaves with their manumission papers. A task many lawyers of the era wouldn't even entertain. <clears throat> uh, how do I interact with this? The heck? Oh, scan the card catalog. There we go. I had to hold it down to get that to work. What's up, turtle dude? How you doing today? Pick up the card. Uh, Fen says he's more of a Superman guy. Uh, why do you think they haven't ever really made a Superman game? I don't know. I don't know. It's not like they couldn't do it today. If they did Sp Sp Spider-Man, they definitely could do Superman. I don't know. <clears throat> you know, very simply, maybe the Superman's just not that popular anymore, right? I'd say Batman, Spider-Man, they're all more popular than Superman. Um, Locate the record up here. Is that it there? Aha, it's a drawer. Must be what Harley was looking for. A random file. Okay, a random file. I think I've got what Harley wanted. Now to get her to give me that book. But how does this tie into what Batman was investigating? What's this? Oh, the business card again. That's the same thing. I thought it was something different. Okay, we're getting out of here. What are we having for dinner? Uh, I believe my wife is going to try a new recipe today. We have several new ones to try. 
So I don't know which one she's trying. One is like a, a special Asian type of uh, bowl that includes like grilled chicken, a peanut butter sauce, spinach, sweet potatoes, rice, and other things. And another one is uh, chicken parm bake. But I don't know which one she's going to go for today. We did just have Italian recently, so maybe she'll go for the Asian style. I don't know. From that particular record. She must have a reason. Here's hoping she actually tells us. Okay. Ooh, there we go. Okay, we gotta get past these guys, huh? I can't leave these criminals alone for one second. Yes, you can. Screw them. Oh, you have to fight them all. What are you talking about? Uh, what's funny is they have all these criminals here, but you don't have to fight any of them. I mean, you can, but you don't have to. So if you don't want to waste time, you just skip them. Is this how Blackgate Prison normally is? I mean, do we just happen to appear during a riot, or is this like a normal business as usual here, right? Seems pretty weird. Harley. Ugh. Ah. Uh, you back. Yeah, what did you think I'd be doing? Am I done running errands? Gimme. <laughs> Gimme. What are you, four years old? Now, how will I get this to you? Oh my god, her voice is annoying. She's so high pitched. She could have escaped at any time she wanted. Because there's holes in the bars. All available guards to red block. Play nice. Chase the balloon. Of course. No other way but through. I can't move. The stupid camera? Rotate it to the enemy who I don't want to fight. I want to chase the balloon. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Dude, jump for it and miss. <laughs> What's with the random rock music? Alright, so I have to destroy everything. Great. Ready? What is with this music? What is this music? Oh, this is the Livin' La Vida Loca. The remake of Livin' La Vida Loca. It sounds terrible. I mean, I didn't like the original either, but this is really bad. <laughs> this is this terrible song. Oh my god. <laughs> Yo, it's so bad. <laughs> it's like a girl screaming into her into her fucking shower head or something, right? Oh my god! How is this? This is completely not the style of the song at all. Oh my god! The heavy attacks are the only things we're using. Like, doing light attacks don't really do that much. The heavy attacks stun everything, see? 
So I'll just keep doing the heavy over and over. A perfect evader right there. This music is so bad. Oh, finished it. Very nice. Yikes. She's doing heavy attacks. She stuns her. Stun her. Look, she can do anything. Look at this riveting gameplay. She didn't even do anything. <laughs> thank you, Bookworm, for becoming a channel member. I appreciate that, Bookworm. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> that was really bad. <laughs> that, that was really badly done, that music. What now? To... Like I said, it sounds like a like a freaking a teen girl singing in her shower. Even the even the quality of this the audio sounded like it was in someone's shower. <clears throat> what part of this did Batman actually ask for? God. It's like four hundred pages of insanity, right? Super secret crime weapon? <laughs> har 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 very funny visit an unlikely source at Blackgate Penitentiary there you go that was bad Jesus stay cool you see him soon huh what does that mean Jay <clears throat> Yeah, you can tell she's gonna probably be a recurring character because she's so popular right now in DC. I don't know why. <clears throat> it's just like there's certain characters that people just for some odd reason can't get enough of. She's one of them. I don't know why. Like, yeah, she was cool in the Batman animated series. And yeah, it was really cool to see her in the original Batman Arkham Asylum game. Do I really need to see her in every single piece of Batman lore and property for the past 20 fucking years? No, I did not. I, I, I get tired of it, honestly. <clears throat> Especially when I don't even think the current version of, of Harley Quinn in the movies is good at all. The Margot Robbie version, I think, sucks ass. I don't know why people even think it's good. It's not accurate to the character. So anyway, that's my little nitpick. You can like Harley Quinn if you like, but I'm just tired of it. I really am. Okay. To the Belfry! So, oh, let's see here. An anonymous tipper tipped me a dollar fifty and says, "So one of the dev team thought that that cringe song was going to be epic. What song would you have used for that instead?" Oh man. I mean, if you're going to go for a song that you want during combat, you know, there's so many different things you could do. You could go for an instrumental that's kind of like hard hitting, has some bass to it. You could go for it's like Matrix like, you know. You could go for an actual real rock song. <clears throat> you know, there's so many choices, and let's remake a pop song from the 90s, which, by the way, no one listens to anymore, cares about, of a guy who was recently exposed to essentially be, like, a, a crazy criminal. You know, Ricky Martin, sadly, he's been accused of many crimes. Um, and let's, uh, <laughs> let's make that our song with, with some kind of a weird teen indie garage band style redo of the song. It doesn't, make, it doesn't make any sense. Just let's just face it. It makes no fucking sense. Okay. Let's continue. Fens says, Harley has become exactly like Deadpool. They kept taking it and milking it, and now it's totally dead and soulless. I get... You know, when the first Deadpool movie came out, I liked it a lot. And when the Deadpool video game came out, I liked it a lot. But after that, I had, like, no desire. And I, I never even saw Deadpool 2. Like, I don't care. 
You know what I mean? Like, it was cool to see it when it finally happened. Do I necessarily need 400 Deadpool movies? No, I do not. But one was enough for me, <laughs> you know? <clears throat> They're talking about Penguin. Yep. Gangster tried and convicted for a litany of financial and violent crimes. Copperpot insists he's turned over a new leaf after serving his time. He insists he's turned over a new leaf. And we always believe him, of course. So it looks like we actually can do a lot of upgrades now. <clears throat> um, Wait a minute. Do you think I can change characters? Because if I can, I actually want to try out Robin for the first time. Here we go. Let's switch to Robin. Yes. John Wick says the Harley Quinn show is a good example of being able to sh throw in woke stuff without it sounding forced. I wouldn't know. I've never seen it, right? Isn't it on HBO or whatever? Yeah, I don't have that, so I've never even seen the show. Okay. Um. Let's see. So a couple things. First of all, let's look at his styles. Oh, Lord. Look at... This is the current Robin suit. Now, we haven't seen the different suits. Want to look at them first? Here, let's let's take off my webcam. Let's look at the different Robin suits, okay? The new guard, I mean, it's just a reskin. It looks exactly the same, just a recoloring. Titan, this is supposed to be Teen Titans Robin, I guess. Eternal. That's, oh, that's, um, that's the Robin. Yeah, it has the Robin, the different Robin symbol on his chest. Year one. Neon Noir. Demon. Demon Robin doesn't look that bad at all, actually. Privateer. I don't know who the hell these privateer skins are supposed to be. They're so weird. Metal. Okay. Night Ops looks pretty good, actually. I kind of like that one. <clears throat> Shinobi, I don't I like any of the Shinobi costumes. Talon, I, I hate the Talon costumes. Like, legit, I think they're the worst. Knighthood is good. And, of course, everyone's saying Knighthood's the best ones. Okay. Um, let's mess around here. Cowl. <clears throat> Definitely, that's the worst one. That's good. That's good. Let's see what other things we can do here. Symbol. Let's do that one. This one. Gloves. Oh, I like the red and boots. Red boots. So with this color scheme, he's completely like different. He only has green <clears throat> on the pants. That sucks you can't change the pants. I guess we'll go with this. Now, <clears throat> what we're going to do... <clears throat> excuse me. We were going to try to craft stuff, but it looks like the only thing we can craft for him right now is his better melee. Looks like we have to earn more stuff for him to go higher. Um, let's equip that and we break this down. Um, what about abilities? So once again, I got to do perfect evades. Everyone has to get perfect evade first. Yep. Now he can get, here's his special abilities. Here, I can take my webcam back now. His special abilities. He's got light-footed. Robin produces no sound while running. He moves faster while crouched, does not apply while sprinting. Okay. Invo elemental charge. Elemental effect buildup is inflicted by Robin is increased 25% faster. I didn't even know he had an ele elemental buildup. <clears throat> Excuse me. And I think these are the more generic ones over here. I can't... There we go. Yeah, Robin critical damage or... Robin's decoy inflicts a large amount of elemental effect damage on the attacking enemy. He has a decoy, huh? No, I'm going to go with this. I like this. Light footed. We're going to go with that. <clears throat> okay. We can't upgrade any of this yet, right? Level 3 to hit this. Oh, wait. I have it. I have a better suit. Flash forward suit. Look at that. <clears throat> so we equipped a different suit now. <clears throat> I don't know how we got another suit, but I had one. So I equipped it. But now it looks completely different. We got to change the style again. Yeah, look. I don't know why it changed uh, the appearance. Okay. No, this is not a sequel to the Arkham games. <clears throat> okay, let's advance the plot. I think we have to talk so to Alfred. To <laughs> well, oh, wait, wait a minute. What's that? 
chaos. There's an optional on fire. an optional cutscene over here. For our friend to stay in her cell. But then again, this is that day we're talking about. Here we go. She knew our priority. An optional Robin scene. Playing chess with Alfred, huh? Playing with the ghost, Alfred. One could say your offense is like playing a ghost. You're pathetic. You might say that. <laughs> I'm finishing my last game with Bruce. I couldn't save our board from the manor, but I do have our notes. We tracked each move. To continue the game, if one of us was ever away. Are you winning? <laughs> Playing as Bruce, I can't see how he loses. Bruce is dead. Maybe he wins your game, but without him, we've lost. I'm not so <clears throat> sure about that. Not so sure he's dead? Not so sure we've lost. Bruce played an important role, but he never saw himself as the only piece in play. Mm -hmm. Interesting. Kevin says, with all the customizations, it looks like this game might have been a live service game like Avengers. You're right. And, you know, a lot of people have drawn that con connection or parallel <clears throat> that it looks like maybe originally they were going for Avengers. But what the hell is this? Spy Hunter. Oh, I, I played Spy Hunter back in the day in arcades. Yeah, I don't know if I want to do that right now. Um, <clears throat> excuse me. Yeah, um... Oh, so by the way, now if look, everything's open. Look, the projector works. Or the TV. I guess the screensaver for the TV, right? Everything, remember, it was covered before, and now it's not covered. I guess the further you get into the game, um... The more uh, evolves here in their base. But... No, but, um... Uh, you know, the rumor is, and it is a rumor, it's not confirmed, that this was supposed to be a live service game first, just like Avengers. But then when Avengers completely tanked, they basically retooled the game to be more of a different kind of experience because they felt that it was going to, again, tank just like Avengers um, <clears throat> if it stayed the same. So. Okay. Here we go. So... What are we on right now? We did, yeah, we did this, the Langstrom hard drive. None of these say they have challenges to do. No. So I guess we just gotta talk to Alfred over here. Okay. <clears throat> it says talk to Alfred to advance the story. <clears throat> Excuse me. Okay, here we go. Thinking about what happened at Blackgate. How's the, the how's the volume, guys? You need it louder. Have known Harley would try something. Now she's off to do Harley stuff. She hasn't left any other messages or maps. Do you yes. Have any leads okay. on where she might have gone? Not yet. But she's worked with the freaks before. Maybe they know something. A good place to start then. Okay. Look at that. Alfred teleported. Open Harley's book and analyze her evidence. <clears throat> wow. Harley's profiled some seriously antisocial prisoners here. Look, something's going on at Blackgate. We lean on that warden, we're set. Oh, these records go back centuries, man. The warden's new. Now she's involved. How did I miss this? Oh, right. Harley's stupid system makes no sense. Babs. Hey, Babs, what did you figure out? <laughs> they all got out on appeal. That's what Harley was tracking. In every case, key witnesses were murdered. Look, 
They were all pinned up with knives. We got a serial Just killer. Just like Langstrom. Bruce is on to something. Yeah. Oh? I think I've got something. Oswald Cobblepot, the penguin. He's like everyone else in here. Except he served his sentence every single time he was arrested. Huh. Someone must have hung him out to dry. Might be he's willing to talk. He runs the Iceberg Lounge now. Claims he went legit. <laughs> he definitely runs more than liquor through that bar. I wouldn't know. That man would never take me. If you wanted a fake ID, Tim, all you had to do was ask. Oswald's <laughs> dangerous. And we can't forget, Harley's still out there. We have to be careful. Relax. Dick. Dick! <laughs> we got this. Why are you such an asshole? I thought he was just, like, unhinged and, and, like, pissed because of the things that had happened to him, the torture and everything. I didn't know he was, a, like, they made him a complete dick in this, right? <clears throat> Loose ends. Complete case file one, Batman's last case. Okay. They just made him a dickhead. <laughs> Check your email. What? Got big plans from Harley Quinn. Hiya, baby bats. The party at Blackgate was a lot of fun. I just stuck around, but I couldn't miss the three-for-one deal at Taco Dirty. Anyway, now that batsy has gone, all we have, we'll have so much fun. I can't wait to show you what I'm working on, so stay tuned. Oh, great. A PR problem? Like, there's all these... Oh, look, the Titans send their love from Cassie Sandsmark. Which one was Cassie? Uh, which Teen Titan is Cassie? I don't know their real names. Raven Darkholm is Raven, right? I don't know who the hell Cassie is. Starfire, maybe? I don't have no idea. Anyway. <clears throat> huh. He thought his secret identity had been compromised. See that? <clears throat> Wonder Girl? I don't even know who the hell that is. <laughs> I have no idea who Wonder Girl is. I have another AP point. They just gave it to me. Um... How do I get to this one? I can't I can't click over to it. Robin's damage is increased while undetected. Look at that. So being in stealth makes him a lot better, apparently. Um I can't get this one yet. Robin can take perform a special takedown and suspends enemies from a vantage point. It's the it's Batman's takedowns. Yep. It's hard to move around these menus, actually. Oh wow. Robin can do takedowns on larger enemies? Oh shit. That's pretty good. I might want to save up for that, but that's three points. That would take a while to get, I think. <clears throat> I think I'll, I'll... Since I'm just starting to use them, I think I will hold off. But does it say I can do anything different with the suit? Improved suit. Yeah, look at this. So this will give me... Oh, it's a completely look, different looking suit. It's power up, and then you get elemental armor resistance. I should probably get that, huh? I have it, I guess. I guess I already had it. Look at that suit. It's completely different looking. Huh. When did I get that? I don't even know. Right? Oh. Did I just earn it or did I have it? Oh, you can't see? Oh, my God. I'm, I'm sorry, guys. Here you go. Look how different it looks. Right? It's completely different. I guess I don't know if I can mess with how it looks. I can. Because I don't, I don't like the whole face blocked. We'll go with that. We'll go with that. Okay. <clears throat> Excuse me. I hate this. I feel like I'm waiting for the other shoe to drop. So I guess that's it. Reach the iceberg lounge. We're gonna go talk to Penguin now. Mind that okay. Harley, there's no way she's not planning something. But I've been El Grey Zoro says, you know, I like the concept of hurting. multiple characters and a multiplayer would have been worked great for a Teen Titans game. Indeed, I guess so, right? Having a super team work together and trade off a different task, different missions and stuff. I think that would have worked. Yeah. <clears throat> I agree. <clears throat> So there's the Iceberg Lounge. Right? So there's our story. But along the way, I guess I could do some of these uh, little mini-missions. Since they are along the way. What's this? 
secret cache. <clears throat> Let's do a couple of these little mini missions on the way. Look how long that shit is. That's crazy. Gotham City Broadcasting. There we go. Okay, Green Gotham. ability like a helicopter blade right that was neat he hit his teammate but then he did hit me too where do you get this techno suit from here we go let's do it again spin to win yeah i like that i like that ability pretty unique i can't i couldn't jump over the fence they wouldn't let me jump over that fence. There, wasn't there a chest? Here it is. I'm gonna say, I didn't say there was a chest right here. They were guarding a chest. What's that? There's some security cameras. Probably stolen from a nearby store. Okay. Alright, that's done. What, uh... There's another one right here, so we'll do the two that are along the way. Maybe we'll get the cash, and then we'll go to the story mission. Right? Pepsi Man says, I like how the enemies can hit each other by accident. I actually do. I do like that. How many video games do you play that all the enemies are immune to each other's attacks, and how the fuck does that ever make any sense? Right? That never makes any sense. That's so stupid. If the enemy's dumb, then let them hit each other. Right? Dodge perfectly. Line them up. <clears throat> make them all attack each other, work them against each other to their own disadvantage. I, I really like that about this game. Wait a minute. Oh, the crime's right there. I'm stupid. Oh, I guess we're not doing it. I already passed it. Yeah, forget it. Let's do, um... Let's do the stash instead. Let's do the stash. Let's see what this is. Uh, over here? <clears throat> Bruce Wayne, secret stash. Only the stickiest of bat icky. <laughs> yes, didn't you know Bruce Wayne was a toker? Of course he was. Can you, how could you be a superhero for that long, go through all that much, and not be smoking, dude? Oh, by the way, Jerry had re-upped his membership for nine months. I completely missed it, and he asked me, um, do you like... Email like Kelly Robin or here. Stephanie Robin. I don't think I've ever seen anything with those two at all. Mm. Robin Secret cash. To find rewards and more inside each one. Reach each of the emitters and then it's time to unlock. Oh, there's a time limit? Oh, okay, here we go. <clears throat> go. Identity verified. Location of cash added to AR device. Look at that. Bruce Wayne audio log. You found one of Bruce's audio logs to chronicle his career as Batman. Hey, this Alfred. Personal... There was this personal cash that I guess Bruce squirreled away out in the city. Some pretty neat stuff was inside. You know, Master Bruce was fond of having a backup plan. The supplies in those compartments often saved him a long trip back to the Bat Cave. I expect if you look hard enough, you'll find similar caches across Gotham. Cool. I'll keep my eyes open for more. That is cool. Something to do. And, you know, I just noticed. Look how different he looks now. He looks good, right? Remember the original outfit? I said, wow, it looked like shit. It just looked like a kid in a cosplay outfit from, like, Hot Topic. He looks really good now. This outfit that we put on him. I don't know how we even got it. I like it. 
Oh, I like it. There it is. That's got to be the Iceberg Lounge. Why else would it be all blue, right? Hey, Batman would find a different way in. Of course he would. So, Robin should too. Here we go. Moxra says, if you look at challenges in the menu, you can see what you have to do for the heroic traversal, like back row glide. Once you do it, you'll unlock the knighthood skill tree. <clears throat> Again, I looked at them yesterday, and they look very grindy. Do seven or eight generic crimes, kill three mini-bosses, which I don't even know how you get mini-bosses, you know. <clears throat> I really dig this Robin outfit. I, I have a complete 180 attitude. I think he looks good. He looks like a superhero. What's this? Examine the hat. Looks like Clock King's on timeout. <laughs> oh, it's Clock King's hat. A cobble pot coin. I wonder if they were ever in circulation. <laughs> U.S. tax code. Hello, Mr. Baxter. Doing some light reading, Penguin. The thing that gets me is they say the Penguin is free and he's running a legit business. The Penguin. The Penguin, a supervillain who killed people, is free. Uh... Captain Boomerang's Boomerang. Oh, no. He really didn't have the most original name, did he? No, he's he's one of the worst. Pretend like he doesn't exist. <clears throat> that trick umbrella. Classic Penguin. The mini-bosses are part of a freak's gang. Oh, really? I don't think I've, I've encountered them yet. Do I take these guys out? Yes, I do. Murder this bodyguard! Murder! Oh, there's a lot of people in here. Oh, crap. Here we go, here's the music now. It's a clubbing music. Have you heard this music? Did they just say, I hope the bat shows up? Even though I guess they don't know Batman's dead. I guess it's not common knowledge that Batman's dead yet. <clears throat> um. I want to get over there. But I don't see a way to do it. Maybe you have to go, go ground first and then go up. Look at that. <laughs> Look at the umbrellas. Umbrella lights. Oh. Dancing Dugas. Look out. There's a guard right there. He's looking at me. He's a jerk. Son of a bitch. How do I get across? I don't know. I don't see a way to get across on the deck. Shit. Son of a bitch. Everywhere I go, I see a guard. I see a guard going around. I don't like that. I'm trying to jump. The game won't let me jump. So I'll go this way. Hopefully I'll grab this guard. Oh, the music slowed down. It's a different beat now. Nice. Remember, I have his ability to be more quiet when I'm sneaking. Because I already bought it. So when you walk or sneak, you're very quiet. They may not be able to hear me. Scuffed Jake says, if you grind random crimes, you'll come across big guys with shields. You beat those for a knighthood objective. I already beat one. I just beat one, right? Or was that guy the guy with the big uh, power gloves? Those don't count. What's this? Oh, I got a chest. Random chest. And we got, what's this? Band list. The Iceberg Lounge list of band individuals features the typical type of Clientele performing precisely the type of bannable offenses you'd expect. Brawling, theft, destruction of property. Bruce Wayne's name and photograph appears at the top of the worst offenders list. Following inappropriate behavior, Mr. Wayne is not permitted under the Iceberg Lounge in any circumstances. Well, I mean, he's dead, so yeah, I guess he can't come in. Big Tuna did a Super Chat saying, All these free criminals, Gotham must have had the same justice system as we do. Big Tuna, thank you for the Super Chat. I mean... Yeah, I mean, I'm shocked to hear that Penguin is somehow a free man running a business. I mean, if he was a super villain and he really hurt so many, killed so many people, right? How would he be free 
to run a business. That doesn't seem to make sense to me, right? Certainly not, but I guess, uh, you know, <laughs> not everything makes sense. Oh, let's see here. I received a $20 tip from One Minute Man. Indeed, I have. Okay. Okay. So thank you to One Minute Man. There we go. <clears throat> My batteries are low. That's not good. <clears throat> Um, I need to swap that out right now before it dies. Let's play One Minute Man's animation. Oh, where is it? Here it is. Piece of paper just hit the floor. <laughs> okay. Um, let's swap out the battery now before I get too far into the mission and then I get screwed up, right? <clears throat> okay. I do need a controller. Oh, shit. Son of a bitch. Get there. Ow. I just kicked the camera. Son of a bitch. I kicked it. Hope I didn't screw it up. I think I screwed it up. Is it crooked now? I kicked it and I think it's crooked. It doesn't look straight at all. Ugh. Hold on. What did I do here, man? Yeah, it's definitely crooked. I fucked it up. <clears throat> okay, hold on. <clears throat> so I need to turn it slightly angled to the right. little better. Almost straight now. Okay, I think we're good. Uh, what is the DualSense Edge? Is that the one that's the, the, the ridiculous $200 controller coming out that I already talked about and said, holy shit, that's way too expensive? I don't know. Okay. Let's continue. We're going to take a break soon, but let's continue on with this mission. I got to take out five more guards, huh? So that's all that was down there. A couple optional things. Yes, it's a two hundred dollar controller. I mean, that's ridiculous. It's too expensive, especially because we already know from the Xbox Elite controllers these things don't even last. They break. I don't really see a way to take these guys out with stealth. Like they're gonna see me. distract them, right? There's no, like, you can't make a, dis uh, uh, a diversion. So Gomez says, where are the glasses at? They're right here. I didn't put them on because I forgot. Sorry. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. I didn't mean to do that. See, like, I don't think he ever, he's never going to turn around. I might just have to fight him head up, which I don't want to do. I was going to try to be stealth, but <clears throat> I don't think you can just do it. I think I just got to run up and fight him. All right, fuck this. <laughs> They fell. They're so afraid. That is this shot. No. I'm not stopping until you're dead. Where'd everybody else go? Where'd everyone else go? You just saw me destroy them all. Now. Where'd everyone else go? <laughs> now, is there any other additional things I missed? Any items? Uh, I think I did see a chest down there. 
Excuse me. Yeah, right over here. How do I get to that? This way? Yup, looks like a little storeroom. Cool. Everyone keeps asking me the same question. I'm not next gen tactics. Same question. He says, What are your thoughts on the game? Is it as bad as the gaming community is saying it is? Right now, I don't dislike it. But we're still early on. Like, we're, not, we're only like four hours into it. So, we're basically in the intro segments. It's very possible the game will become grindy and shitty, like the reviews say. I haven't encountered that yet. But that doesn't mean that I, mean, I won't. <clears throat> you know? Lock. I guess I need to get creative. Lock? Come on. <laughs> That door's sandalwood. Custom job. Fixing it's gonna be a pain in the ass. Sorry, forgot I had a door. But now that I'm here... Smile. Viral video of you assaulting a reformed citizen is the last thing you need right now. <laughs> well then, do us both a favor. Tell me why you served your time when your friends didn't have to. Do you just like prison? <laughs> Hmm. Someone's done their homework. I want to know who's handing out the get out of jail free cards. He looks very penguin like in this one. If you really want to go down this rabbit hole, you need to know there's no coming back from it. That won't stop me. I'm going to spell this out for you. With the back gone, you're not worth my time. <laughs> Get lost. Wow. <clears throat> beat it. Beat it. Beat it. Beat it. <clears throat> Hold on. It's his uh, trick umbrella over here. I got work to do. Chessboard. Couple pies cheating, it says. You know, those are all custom made. Is this trick Very umbrella. expensive. Who's cheating at chess? Come What's back this? when you're serious. His guns. <clears throat> His pistol. Yeah, antique firearms. Hey, careful. Academic Some books. Of the first editions. <laughs> Why is he letting me even look? Did he get the fuck out? Call the police. Wash your ass out, right? Every villain seems to be modeled after the new movies. Was there a penguin recently? In the movies? I didn't see any of the recent movies. Is he supposed to be the Colin Farrell penguin? Is that what that is? Robert Pattinson's penguin? Okay. Was it Colin Farrell who played him? I don't remember. Or did he play someone else? Belfry. No luck with Penguin. Whatever he knows, he's not sharing. All right. Come back to the Belfry and we'll regroup. Will do. See you soon. So we gotta go back to the Belfry. Any new... Look at this, there's actually Harley Quinn things to do. Bomb threat. Another one of these bomb threats. This one you don't even know. Heist at Star Labs. You have to be level 5 to 8 to... Suggested to do it, and I'm definitely not level 5 to 8. I'm only level 3, right? So I probably shouldn't do that yet. <clears throat> well, let's see. No, honestly, between me and the Belfry, the only other thing to do would be another uh, secret cache. So I guess we'll do the secret cache, and then we'll probably take a break. Um, let's see here. I believe I just got the email for One Minute Man's tip. I did. It came way, way late. Some of these emails are coming through way late. So every once in a while, I'm, I'm just going to have to check, I guess, for myself um, to see what's coming through. And then on top of that, I think I just got another tip. And I accidentally deleted the email for it because it wasn't loading. Yeah, 
I just received a $2 tip from an anonymous person. They said the motorcycle in the game is ass compared to the Batmobile in Arkham Knight. Let's be real. I agree. I think that <clears throat> it's it's pretty lame. It's it's not as maneuverable, not as fun to drive. Doesn't look or feel as nice. And because the low frame rate also, uh, you know, has issues even maneuvering it. You know what I mean? Because the frame rate is so bad when you're driving it. So it's kind of like everything. Everything together is kind of like, ah. Uh. All right, so. Let's do the stash. And then when we're done with that, we'll probably get into the belfry, go down break, and come back and play for about another hour and a half, two hours, depending on how much time we have left. I like, I actually kind of like Robin right now, and I thought I wasn't going to like him. He's more stealthy. He has that ability where he spins his bow staff around, which is nice. Um, I like his look. Wait, what's that? Hold, 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 hold. What is this? What do I do? It's just there, but I can't do anything with it? Or maybe it has something to do with the stash? Maybe it has to do with the stash. Okay. Oh, hold on. Ah. 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 Ooh. Okay. My eyeballs. Robin recognized. Identity verified. Location of cash added to AR device. Right there. Yep. New cash. Okay. Do you always get a Bruce Wayne audio log when you do those? Because we didn't hear them. I guess we have to go to the menu to hear them. Because I assumed it would just play automatically. It's not playing them automatically. There's one more crime here. Let's do the crime, then we'll go on break. Well, let's do this crime quickly. Here we go. Stop and this will... How you guys doing? Here. You're doing? Where'd he go? He ran away. What the? You all right? Cop got assaulted. The guy's running away. Am I supposed to chase him? Oh, I guess I was supposed to chase him. Oops. That's it? All you do is beat him up. <laughs> All you have to do is beat the shit out of him. Very nice. Okay. Yeah, we'll go back to the Belfry for now. It actually shows another stash over there. Fast travel. Oh. Good. You can fast travel to the Belfry when you're done. We were patrol. Okay. Retro Parasite did a super chat. He says, Batgirl is my favorite playstyle so far. I don't know. I think I like Robin right now. And I didn't think I would. I honestly didn't think I was going to like Robin at all. I think I, his playstyle is pretty good. And now that we got a better look for him too, got some more data for the I actually board. feel like uh, he's a better version of Robin than I thought he was gonna be. You know. Police are investigating the involvement of one of Gotham's most notorious. All right, so we're back. We're gonna advance the plot. See what happens. 